What's going on guys, Nemesis here, welcome back to the channel, in today's video I got a pretty cool video for you guys, I'm actually going to be playing this classic challenge and I'm going to be using this P.E.K.K.A Ram Rider deck, I've gotten a few requests to actually play Ram Rider P.E.K.K.A, so yeah, without further ado, please make sure to like and subscribe, and let's get straight into it. Okay, so we've got our first game here, <clears throat> and we got Snowball, Baby Dragon, Banted, and Electro Wizard, I think this is probably the best Ram Rider deck or Pekka Ram Rider deck, um, it's definitely very consistent, it's been, obviously, like, if you see Pekka Ram Rider, it's always, most likely, more likely than not going to be this version, um, it's just, like I said, very consistent, uh, it has a lot of defense capabilities, I think Pekka Ram Rider is a lot more defensive as opposed to playing Pekka Bridge Spam, like, the regular Bridge Spam variations, because that variation is, like, super aggressive, but this variation with, like, Ram Rider, it's a lot more defensive, it's a lot more beatdown style, so, like, you could like, build up bigger pushes in the back, um, you can't really pressure more effectively at the bridge, but like I said, it's a lot more defense oriented, I would like to say, whereas uh, the regular P.E.K.K.A. Bridge Bam is more offense oriented, so yeah, uh, he's going to go for a, uh, <clears throat> an executioner right there with, with skeletons, I'm just going to go for an Electro Wizard in the back, plus my Barbarian Barrel right there, perfect timing, perfect, perfect, I might go in, but I'm not too sure, he, this guy, yeah, this guy definitely has Tornado, right, I think he definitely used a Tornado, I'm going to go for a Bandit because I don't think he has Tornado back in rotation. And if he does, then this is a really bad play, to be honest. Okay, yeah, perfect. That's what I that's what I thought. So I'm going to go for a Peck in the middle just to DPS down this giant skeleton real quick. And I'm probably just going to go for a Ram Rider. And I'll probably go for a Ram Rider same lane. It depends because I want this Pekka to act as a tank for my Ram Rider. So right now should be the time. I actually might have mistimed it. Yeah, I mistimed it. Oh my gosh, that's so bad. That is so bad. Oh, we still get a connection though. See, but that's what I'm saying. Like, if I didn't miss time that, okay, that was actually a pretty interesting um, um, tornado. I'm gonna go for baby dragon in the back. I know I have a good elixir advantage, so yeah, let's take advantage of that. Um, let's see. Like I said, he's got giant skeleton. He's also got executioner nato with a cannon. This is our matchup, I would like to say, because of um, Pekka for the giant skeleton, and we also got lightning for his executioner plus. <clears throat> his cannon, so lightning gets a ton of value in this matchup. Unless he just like uses zap, he's out of nowhere or something. But typically, when you're playing this deck, you always want to play a rammer to behind the uh, Pekkas, just like that. It's just the best play to do. Let's see what he wants to do here. I don't want to take a lightning on top of that. I think that's way too aggressive. I wanted to get more value, like if you play like an executioner again or something. Okay, I'm definitely gonna lightning that just because I don't have a Pekka in hand. So I didn't want to like have an awkward defense against that. Lightning will just take care of that really good. I'm going to play a little bit defense because I don't know what this guy actually... Okay, there it is. I knew he had like some kind of win condition, but I wasn't exactly sure. So Pekka's going to clean that up very nicely. I'm probably going to go for a Rammer in the back again. <clears throat> this might go into overtime to be honest with you. Okay, uh, let's see here. I'm going to go for a Baby Dragon all the way out here. Just DPS down that... Um... Uh... Actually, let me do this. Uh, okay, that's not going to get a connection. Okay, this is totally fine. Uh, I think I'm going to go for a band in the back, potentially, right here. Where's this Hog Rider at? There's a Hog Rider. I think that gets a shot because I didn't have the exact amount of Elixir to defend that Hog Rider. He's going to go for Skeletons in the middle. I probably should start predicting that a little bit more, to be honest. I'm going to go for a uh, Ram Rider over here because I know he's going to Giant Skeleton, so I don't want it to go into the Death Bomb of the Giant Skeleton. I'm probably going to go for another lightning. Oh my gosh, should we just hit a cannon? Oh no, we didn't. <laughs> I thought we hit a cannon. You know, check this out. I'm going to do this. Actually, do I snowball? I probably should have snowballed, to be honest. Okay, we have... Oh my gosh. Okay, no, you know what? We're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. We're going to do this. We're going to go for... <sighs> Maybe we're not fine. Okay, that's definitely not good. I was I was not expecting the giant skeleton to uh mm, Okay, this is not good. I'm gonna go for this. I gotta go for lightnings again. I'm 
Mal gucken, was noch war. Uh. Oh. My. Gosh. Wow. Well, that was kind of scary. That one play where the giant skeleton won the other side and I pick up the op opposite lane, that was basically the biggest misplay. Otherwise, it wouldn't even been that close, to be honest. But yeah, GG's. Let's go for the next game. Okay, so we've got a nice game here against Big Noob. <laughs> oh, we got Rain Rider, Snowball, Electro Wizard, and Pekka. Let's see what this guy wants to do. Typically, with this version of Pekka, I don't even want to like cycle first because, like I said, this stack is more defensive. It's a bit heavier in Elixir, like the Ram Rider as opposed to Battle Ram. Lightning as opposed to you know, like a Fireball or Poison. But just for the sake of the video, I'm probably just going to cycle a Snowball. Um, yeah, this guy still isn't making a play. Okay, there it is. Finally. Like, I didn't really want to cycle anything because I had no bandit or, or like a bar barrel. So, yeah. Electro Wizard for the Dark Prince should be nice. I'm probably going to protect this with like a Ram Rider. Okay, he's going to go for that. So, so Cage plus a Dark Prince plus that. Um, uh, what is this? Like... I really don't know. Okay, that's going to provide some kind of uh, counter push right there. So let's see what he wants to do for it. Oh, he's going to do that. That's a pretty interesting play. That's definitely a very interesting play on his end. I don't really agree with that. So he just dumps six elixir. And I'm probably just going to go for a really massive counter push with this. So baby dragon behind this. Um, he probably can't defend this that well. I'm going to go for an electro wizard as well. Just to try to hit this... Um, um, yeah, Dark Prince, and we have a really nice counter push, like I said. He probably doesn't have that much elixir. He's probably gonna have to go for a cage right there. With that being said, I'm probably going to also just play this Ram Rider as well. He doesn't have that much elixir. <clears throat> he has no cage or e -whiz anymore for my Ram Rider, so those are his best answers. And that is going to basically be tower right then and there. He's gonna bowler that, which is totally fine. And yeah, so we're chilling. Oh, uh, let's see. Ewis is doing a very solid job, plus the Ram Rider and taking care of that bowler. So let's see. I'm going to go for a banner right here. I'm probably just going to continuously peck up the uh, Royal Giants because it looks like this guy doesn't have a Fisherman, so I don't really need to worry about a Fisherman pull. Uh, let's see here. Where's that Royal Giant at? Uh, yeah, there it is. So I could just peck up that thing. He's going to do that. So that's 10 Elixir with their RG plus the Electro Wizard. So I don't need to worry about something crazy. Uh, let's see. He's going to Lightning. That doesn't really matter at all. He's going to also do that. Well, guess what, man? I got a Lightning for you. So I got a Lightning for you as well. So yeah. <laughs> I also got a Ram Rider for his RG. So if he wants to play an RG right now, which he's not going to really have the Elixir to or the time to even get a push on top of me. I'm just going to go for a Ram Rider right here. Uh, I'm going to go for a P.E.K.K.A. plus a Snowball on top of this um, Goblin Brawler. And yeah, we should basically be chilling. Game number two secured. Let's go ahead and jump to the next one. Okay, so we've got a nice game here. We got Bandit, P.E.K.K.A., Snowball, and Ram Rider. So not a bad hand at all. He's going to give the WoW. I'll just give the WoW as well. And I'll give this little kissy emo because I actually really like this emo. It's really nice. I also like this emote. That's probably one of my favorite emotes right there. Let's go ahead and kick things off with a bandit in the back here. Let's see what this guy wants to do. Uh, I'm going to go for a Ram Rider opposite lane. There's nothing else I can really do here. He's probably going to play Skeletons, I would presume. There it is, the Skeletons. Also, the Hunter is going to get a nice shot on top of my bandit. So what I'm going to probably do here... Oh, okay, he's got that. Okay. I'm probably going to go for a Baby Dragon in the back. Uh, let's see here. Let's see what I want to do here. I'm probably going to go for Barbarian Barrel. Just to kill that um Hunter. Let me see here. I don't really got the best hand. I'm probably going to go for an Electro Wizard. I kind of have to. I don't want to cycle a P.E.K.K.A. just yet. Hopefully he goes for like a Fisherman. Because I'll get a really good Lightning value. But I don't even know if I want to like Lightning that. If he even does do that. I'm going to wait for this Bandit to like hit this RG first, and then, because I want my bandit to act as like a little tank, just in case he wants to play a fisherman. I'm going to go for a snowball as well, because it's a pretty good snowball. Um, hopefully that gets a shot, which it does. 
He probably doesn't have that much elixir. I'm probably just going to go for Barbarian Bell right now, just to DPS down that Hunter and get a little bit of a counter push. Maybe force something out from him, like a Royal Ghost. Yeah, there's the Royal Ghost. But that being said, I'm probably just going to go for an Electro Wizard on top of this thing. <clears throat> Let's see here. I got a Lightning, which is really good for me, as opposed to like a Poison or Fireball, because his troops are really susceptible to uh, Lightning, as opposed to like, you know... Hunter, Fisherman, Royal Ghost isn't like too susceptible, but it does do something. I'm gonna go for a Ram Rider right here. Let's see if he goes for a Lightning. He's gonna go for a Lightning, yeah, he is. I'm gonna go for a um, Barbarian Barrel as well. That's actually really good on his end for doing that. Um. Oh, we get a connection right there. That's super nice. I'm gonna go for a Peck in the back here. Oh, and he's also gonna play Fisherman, which is really bad on his end. I don't really agree with that Fisherman whatsoever. Like I said, I think he just used lightning, right? I wasn't really counting his cycle too much, to be honest, but I think he's definitely back to it. I'm going to go for this. Let's see if he lightnings that. I'm going to go for Ram right in the back, because like I said, it's pretty important to play Ram right in the, the back of the P.E.K.K.A. I'm going to go for a Baby Dragon right here. Okay, I'm going to spam him like crazy. He doesn't have too much Elixir. Um, Yeah, I'm going to go for another P.E.K.K.A. in the back. I mean, that's basically game, right? Okay, not, not game just yet, but basically. I'm going to go for an Electro Wizard right now. Perfect timing. If he goes opposite lane, I got a Ram Rider again. He's going to do another Lightning. Basically, at this point in time, he doesn't even hit the tower with that, I believe. Yeah, so I'm just going to go for a Lightning, because there's nothing he can really do. Ram Rider will hit Skeletons if he does play it, just like this. And yeah, that's going to be game. I think that's game number three. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Let's go for the next one. Okay, so we got a next game here against, I don't know how to pronounce that, but I, every. <laughs> we got uh, Baby Dragon, Barbarian Barrel, Ram Rider, and Pekka. He's going to go for a um, Ice Spear in the back. I'm just going to wait and play Barbarian Barrel on top of that thing. Hopefully my Bar Barrel goes there in time, but I don't think it will. Skeletons will. Oh, I think this is 2.6, which I don't really know the exact matchup percentage. But I'm definitely, I definitely think it's a little bit better. And um, it's better than original Pekka Bridge Bam is what I'm trying to say, but I still think he has matchup. So, yeah, this may not be the best thing ever. Uh, I'm going to go for Baby Dragon in the back. He's going to go for Skeletons. Yeah, he's playing this well by um, protecting that cannon. I think if he goes for Lightning, I might just... Okay, I'm just going to do this. I'm also going to go for a Snowball as well. Oh my gosh, I think I also had to, like, Bar Barrel it. We get a connection right there, but um, we honestly may have our work cut out for us right here because, like I said, I hate playing against 2.6, especially with like Pekka. It's like nothing you can really do. I just gotta wait till double elixir, get really good lightnings off. We're like trying to hit his mus musketeers and his cannons. He's gonna let that go, which is pretty interesting. I'm gonna hover my Pekka just in case he wants to do it. Oh, um, okay, there it is. That's a perfectly timed Pekka, so it's not going to get a shot on his tower. Um, what else? So he just cycled Hog Rider, so he's four cards away from his next Hog Rider. Hopefully he cycles a Musketeer as well, which I don't think he will. It's not the correct play if he does it, because I'll just get a big Lightning. Um, he's going to cycle Skeletons, which I should probably put a Baby Dragon on there, but it, it's whatever. Uh, let's see here. I'm going to do this. I'm going to go for a Snowball as well. I'm gonna go for Bandit because I need to. It's gonna get a lot of a lot of damage. Uh, let's see here. It's gonna get a nice shot off. That's pretty good. I'm gonna go for Electro Wizard in the back. Okay, he's gonna do that. Pretty smart play on his end. Let's see what he wants to do here. Uh, where's that Hog Rider at, man? I'm like literally waiting for a hog rider. That's a lot of oh, he's gonna have to fireball. So at least he he probably knows like my combo now, what I like to do. So he's probably going to like watch out for that. I'm gonna go for a peck in the back. If he goes opposite lane, I gotta he actually literally did that exact same time. I got lightning. Hopefully, uh. Nothing bad happens from this. Mm.
Oh my gosh. Oh, I thought I was actually going to get a connection right there. Uh, I'm just going to honestly kind of stall out a little bit. Sorry I'm being a little bit more quiet right now because this matchup is a lot harder. So, like, I had to focus up a bit more. I'm going to go for a uh, peck in the back. If he goes up his lane, I'm going to go for a ram order right now. I'm going to go for this as well. Oh my gosh, I kind of screwed myself at doing that, not going to lie. I'm going to go for this. Hopefully in triple elixir I can make something happen right here. Okay, he's going to go for that. Okay, I got to really make a really big push now. Oh, that's so much damage. Okay, we can actually do something here. We can do something here for sure. I'm going to go opposite lane here. I'm going to go for a... Uh, interesting play. I might have to go for lightning, to be honest. I didn't mean to play that that lane, to be honest with you. Oh, we actually got the dub. Yeah, we actually got the dub. Let's go. Oh my gosh, man. I hate playing against 2.6, dude, for real. Like, oh, that's so annoying. Let's go ahead and jump to the next game. All right, hopefully we got our final game here against John. We got Bandit, Baby Dragon, Snowball, and Barbarian Barrel. Let's see what this guy wants to do. We have a pretty solid hand too. I'm going to wait a little bit and then play my Barbarian Barrel. Uh, I don't know if I timed that well. I don't think I did. I'm gonna go for Baby Dragon in the back here. I think this is Graveyard, which is not good. If he goes for Baby, okay, he's got that. We may honestly have to lightning this. It's not a bad lightning either. Like, he doesn't have too much counter push anymore. Oh, uh, let's see what he wants to do here. Um, very strange on his end, to be honest. I don't really agree with that. Oh my gosh. I'm going to do that. Um, I think what I got to do here is I got to peck out the back. Or, okay. Let me see. That's he has bowler, man. He has a bowler too. Um, yeah, this guy's got a bowler. I don't even know like what to say to that. I have to like peck of this, don't I? Because I don't want a baby dragon. I need to keep it for like a defense, and or maybe an offensive push. Like convert this peck into offense. Get a good baby dragon with this thing right now. Because he's gonna tombstone, right? So I gotta baby dragon this. If he goes for inferno dragon. I got Electro Wizard. He doesn't have Freeze anymore, I believe. So I'm going to play this right here. And, uh, yeah. Mm. This is going to be a very tough matchup, as you can tell. Because of Bowler. Literally just because of Bowler. He's also going to do that, which is pretty interesting on his end. Uh, I'm going to go for this. I'm also going to cycle a Barbarian Barrel just so I could like cycle my cards right now. He's also got that. Very interesting. You know what? Okay, okay, okay. I was going to try to go for King Activation, but like I don't think it's going to work at all. Because he played a Buller. I'm going to go for this. Oh my gosh. Maybe I could have played a lightning on top of that, to be honest with you. Let's see what he wants to do here. I don't think he could really play anything, right? I mean, I got lightning for the electric dragon, but like... Is it going to be enough is the question. Do I got to go in right now? I got to go in, man. I got to sell out hard. I still got a baby dragon. I still got a baby dragon. 
Okay, we're going, we're getting somewhere. And I think that's actually game. Oh my gosh, I have to like focus up. Woo! Let's go. That's going to be game. I think that's the 12th match right there, so. Uh, yeah, really clean games right there. Let's go ahead and pop the chest open too, because why not? Um, you know, some gold, uh, ice spirits. I'm literally max. It doesn't even matter. So, but yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll do more videos in the future.